Hey, Spooky Gang. I am very excited to talk about my dad, Andrew Gold's mega viral hit, Spooky Scary Skeletons, off of his album, Halloween House. Especially because I just got this illustrated Spooky Scary Skeletons sing-along book in the mail that just came out and it's available everywhere now via Random House Kids. So a little behind the song, my dad wrote this album in the 90s and it's actually one of my earliest memories in the studio. We all sang on this album and he he just loved Halloween and in true Andrew Gold fashion, he made it a whole production in the studio, invited all of his celebrity friends to come and contribute. And he really truly was just like that passionate about Halloween. My dad actually had a podcast in the early aughts where he talks about the making of the song and something he mentioned was that the exercise for the song was to put as many S's in it as possible. So for example, and so forth. So the album Halloween Howls comes out in the mid-90s and wasn't hugely popular, but then in 2005, Disney put out this DVD called Sing Along Songs Happy Haunting, which featured a cover of Spooky Scary Skeletons. And the song was set to some animations that featured a Disney classic uh, animated short from animator of iWorks, who's the same guy who created Mickey Mouse, called the Skeleton Dance. Head to 2010, and the YouTuber TG Ski is looking for the segment and can't find it anywhere online. So he decides to recreate it using the Skeleton Dance animation and the original Spooky Scary Skeletons from the Halloween Howls album. This version seemingly lined up so perfectly, even when the skeletons are xylophoning the spine, it like lines up with the xylophone on the song. Everything blew up on TikTok when Boomer TV, aka Minecrafter 2011, did this iconic dance to the remix version of the song. Here's a photo of me and my sisters carving pumpkins with my dad on Halloween. My favorite memories growing up all have to do with him just making this holiday so special. It's so wonderful to know that this has been able to be a good memory for so many other people in the world too. He unfortunately passed away in 2011, but he was able to see the beginnings of the popularity of this song. He would just be absolutely over the moon to know how it's just become part of the Halloween culture. So happy Halloween. We are so excited to see everyone's dances this year. Stay spooky.